Okay, we're still at the machine segment of HPE Discovery 2016. I have with me Muthu Murugan. He is a researcher with the Chief Technologies Office at HPE. Welcome to the program. Hi. Now we're going to be looking at, it says at the top that you can see, Common Data Fabric, Future Proofing IT with Software Defined Storage. So to figure out what all of that means, Muthu is going to take us through it. Let's go for it. Okay. Um, so as you know, in today's IT economy, um, what you need is uh, a quick transformation from ideas to business value. Yep. Right? So the underlying infrastructure needs to be able to support uh, this continuous value creation in this idea um, economy. Uh, so the IT administrators today are faced with uh, the daunting challenge of uh, being able to manage uh, traditional applications um, that require uh, cost optimization, performance optimization, and scalability from your um, infrastructure, and at the same time, you have um, these new breed of applications uh, that expect uh, agility and flexibility from your infrastructure, right? So there is really no single solution that uh, can cater to the needs of these two different kinds of workloads um, today out there. So that is what we are trying to solve with our next generation data fabric. So software-defined storage um, is growing rapidly, and uh, as you know, HP Storage has uh, tremendous experience with uh, software-defined storage. Um, our store virtual VSA um, was the first real software-defined storage uh, option that was available in the industry, and we have around eight years of experience and uh, 25,000 plus uh, uh, licenses. That those are, those are those figures we're seeing down there right now? Yes. Uh, purchased and uh, uh, so we call data fabric as the next evolutionary step for software defined storage um, so with data fabric what you are um, really doing is um, you're stitching together these different consumption models so you might have a hardware based um, uh, software uh, storage uh, deployment, you could have a virtual machine based deployment, you could have a container based deployment. Uh, so what this data fabric does is it spans across all these three um, deployment and consumption models and um, it future proofs your data center um, with very minimal risk. So this is the architecture of uh, uh, data fabric that we are envisioning. Um, so you could have uh, a single uh, uh, infrastructure solution with a proven uh, management uh, um, uh, solution as, uh, in the form of uh, HPE OneView, um, and you can run uh, any workload with any form factor, right? Um, so the key thing that we're bringing uh, to, uh, to this data fabric is our integration with um, advanced file system. Um, so, so far we have been very successful with our Shore Virtual VSA, which is a uh, block-based product. Um, now we are bringing in file uh, uh, so that uh, we could support uh, workloads that require a file interface as well. So, um, so both uh, by bringing together these uh, proven, um, scalable uh, storage technologies under this umbrella of data fabric, uh, we are helping you future-proof your data center with uh, 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 with uh, very minimal risk and cost and complexity. Thank you. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you.